Hello loves, so today I am going to do a hair tutorial. I got about five or six, one, two, three, four, I think five new products from Eva NYC. Um, they were gifted, but I have only tried a couple of their products firsthand. And now, of course, I've been trying a lot more of them. And I definitely wanted to share because I really enjoyed them. It's kind of a review, but I also really like the products. So, um, yeah, let's just get right into it. Um, first thing is I just showered and I just got out of the shower. My hair is still wet. And when I'm in the shower, I will use this, um... Therapy Session Hair Mask by Eva NYC. If you can see that, I really am liking it. So it is a mask, but it also can be used as just regular conditioner. Um, it deep conditions, repairs, strengthens dry and damaged hair, and you can use as a weekly treatment or an everyday conditioner. So what I do is I wash my hair. I didn't get shampoo, and that's probably the next thing I'm gonna try. But I really like this one. My hair is naturally just like exactly like this. It's just like a slight wave. Um, and then it, as it dries, it gets a little bit frizzier and straighter. But um, yeah, so I really liked it. I use it so far every time I shower. I don't wash my hair every day. Even though I shower every day, I probably wash my hair like two or three times a week. Just depending on like what I'm doing. And I really like the way it's been, like, moisturizing my hair. Because usually I can tell when I need a deep condition. Because I do apply, um, you know, products on, or I do dye my hair. And so I can tell sometimes when they're, my ends are a little bit drier. Because they tend to dry up faster than the roots. But it's really been balancing it out with that mask. And I'm really enjoying that. So I'm just going to brush it out with my mini little brush. And my hair is pretty good. Like if I brush it out when it's wet and I just keep brushing it, it tends to dry a little bit straighter. And if I just let it do its own thing, it tends to dry a little bit wavier. But yeah, I've really been loving that mask. The next thing that I'm going to show y'all, I've actually tried this one before and I really liked it. So when I was able to pick my products, I definitely picked this one. It's the Main Magic 10-in-1 Primer. It has argan oil, sunflower seed oil, 10 benefits, one miracle formula. I love this one. So you're usually supposed to spray it on damp hair and it helps with drying. It also helps with heat protection, um, frizziness. I'm just going to spray that. The other day, I actually put it in my hair and I didn't style my hair. I just wanted to see if it was like helpful on its own. And it definitely was. Even though I didn't um, blow dry my hair that day, I still, like my hair still dried really fast. So it's definitely because of that product. Like I noticed it immediately. I'm just going to make sure all of that is spread out evenly. Ouch. I also recommend using like a wet brush when you do your hair. Mine is currently in my overnight bag in the car and I did not feel like getting it. So I'm just using this one. So yeah, it also has like a really wide, um, wide tooth brush so to prevent breakage so yeah that's kind of like my hairstyle the next thing that I want to show you that I received is this hair dryer it is in the color lavender has a cold setting um two I don't know what these are there's two toddles I guess that have one two and three and then this this one's one, two, three. This one's zero, one, two. I don't know, guys. I've had the same hair dryer for like years. So this is probably just like obvious, and I'm just inexperienced with hair dryers. But yeah, it also came with these two, um, these two applicators. 
So this one, obviously, if you want a little bit straighter with the round brush, this one for curlier hair, so you can just dry it like that. I should definitely let me know if I should do a tutorial with either of these or if I should do like one side and one side. I think that would be fun. But today I'm just going to try regular basic. I haven't tried it out yet. Okay, I am done. Zero, obviously off. One and two are the different levels of um, how high you want it. Let's see. Okay. And one is cooler air, two is just regular air, three is hotter, and then it also does have this little snowflake. I always try to push the snowflake only because less heat. Um, okay, let's try it. So I'm not done all the way, but I was going to just film it off camera and then show y'all my hair dried. But there are a couple things I want to say. I am seriously loving this hair dryer. Maybe it's because like I've used a crappy, just super crappy basic hair dryer. And this one's actually really quality. And I'm so excited to actually have a really good hair dryer. Like y'all have no idea. I like hardly hair hardly dry my hair, but still, like, it's really good to have. Because especially when I'm shooting, I always like I'm on a time limit sometimes and that's really important to have. Another tip that I want to give is if you stand up and then oh, dry your hair upside down like that, it tends to be a little bit faster. And I also wanted to note that it really is t pretty fast. It may also be contributed to this um, primer, but I also thought it was worth noting I do have pretty thin hair uh, so that is also another factor if you're trying to like recreate the look or re try out these products my hair is pretty thin so um, it did cut my hair drying time in half and I'm like almost done I'm literally just have like a couple more sections but um, if you do have thicker hair it is still worth the buy um, in my opinion it's just that it's gonna go even faster for me just because my hair's so thin. Okay, so I really like the way it worked. I'm really excited about it. Um, another thing is I did not have to hold down the little snowflake. It was just automatically really cold and it stayed that way the whole time. So thumbs up for that one. Um, so far I'm really loving the products that I'm using. Um, yeah. So the next thing that I'm going to use, sorry, I can't stop feeling my hair. It's like pretty soft. <laughs> so the next thing I'm going to use is the hair straightener that I got. This one is really pretty. It's like in a purpley star pattern. Um, again, all of this is from Eva NYC and it was gifted. Um, it goes from 140 degrees to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. So yeah. Um, I'm excited to try it. I am going to be honest, I really love my straightener right now, so it's going to be kind of hard to compare. But, of course, I want to give it a fair comparing. So, yeah, I'm just going to part my hair. I only do two sections, like I said, because my hair is so thin and it's so easy to manage. Um... My question is, should I put on more primer or no? Because I don't want to clog my um, scalp or anything and overuse products. But I do also want to make sure that it has full coverage. Again, the primer does 10 things. It does detangles, reduces frizz, strengthens, softens, cuts drying time, adds shine, nourishes, smooths, and protects against thermal and UV damage. 
smooths and protects against thermal UV damage. Oh wait, 10 things. So let's try out the straightener. I'm not putting it on the 450. I probably, it's kind of hard to see. I probably have it on about 300 degrees right now. And I was letting it sit while I was blow drying my hair. I do feel a little bit of pull when I go through this. I don't know, you know how like, usually with my straightener, I don't know if it's because it's hotter or what, maybe I can try to put this on a higher heat level, but I can feel the individual hairs when I go through sometimes, not the individual hairs, but the ones that are out of place, and I usually don't really feel that with mine, which is why I like mine so much, I feel like it just glides, I mean it's working, it's straightening my hair pretty well, and it's still really soft. I just don't like that grainy feel when you pull it through, you know? I don't know if it's maybe because I didn't brush my hair out between the individual strands. But I don't do that with mine, you know? I mean, it's working really well and my hair is really soft. I feel like I'm just really picky because my straightener is so good. This one really is a quality straightener too. Oh yeah, look, it's not as hot. So honestly, it probably just is the heat level. I'm gonna turn it up a little bit. Give it a second or two. So now that I'm thinking about it, I feel like this is more of a product review than a tutorial. I don't know why I said that that much, but I wanted to correct that. Also, my hair feels super soft and like I cannot stop putting it my hands through my hair. I feel like I just got out of the salon. I'm, I promise. Um, I do like the straightener. I think that if I had to rate it, I'd probably give it like a seven and a half. Um, and I would probably give my old one an eight only because I am a little biased. I'm not going to lie. I do like it. It does have to be a little bit hotter, um, in order to get that like smooth flow but it worked really well. I really like it. And I will update you in a bit to make sure that it stays straight. But yeah, I'm really happy with how it came out. I'm really excited for all my new products and I would definitely recommend. Um, I'm just gonna go by and rate really quick. The Therapy Hair Mask, I would probably give an eight. This I'm definitely giving it 8 or 9. Um, this I'm going to give it 7.5. I'll give it an 8 because I really like it. It does make um, dry fast and it, I think I just have to like keep applying it to make sure that it does all the other things. I mean it seems to do it so I'm excited about that. And then my straightener I'm going to do a 7.5. So yeah, um, drop any comments below. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.